Rue Hakamura laughs, smiles amid trade buzz, no comment on if he asked out from Wizards, it was fitting that Hakamura and Kyle Kuzma were the Wizards' leading scorers in Saturday's 138-118 win over the Orlando Magic print by Matthew Paras, The Washington Times, Sunday, January 22, 2023 Rue Hakamura raised his eyebrows, paused for several seconds and started to smile as he answered a question that had nothing to do with his career 30-point night. The Washington Wizards forward, in light of trade rumors that emerged days earlier, was asked if he wants to continue to be a member of the Washington Wizards. Does he want to be traded? I don't know, Hakamura said laughing. Does he think a trade will happen? I guess, he said with a smile. I mean, I don't know. Did he ask for a trade? No comment, he said, again smiling. It was fitting that Hakamura and Kyle Kuzma, 25 points, were the Wizards' leading scorers in Saturday's 138-118 win over the Orlando Magic. After all, both forwards have been strongly linked in trade rumors ahead of next month's February 9 trade deadline, and both put on a show for any interested team watching from afar. Of the two, Hakamura appears the more likely to be moved. The Athletic reported last week that the Wizards have begun trade talks with multiple teams regarding the Japanese native, adding Hakamura has drawn interest from several Western Conference teams in need of scoring. The talks came months after Hakamura, the ninth overall pick in the 2019 draft, and Washington failed to agree on a contract extension in time for the league's October deadline for rookie-scale extensions. As such, Hakamura is on track to become a restricted free agent this summer. Hakamura seems like he wouldn't mind a change of scenery. I just want to be somewhere that wants me as a basketball player, Hakamura said. I want to be somewhere that likes my game, you know? I just want to be somewhere that trusts and believes in me. Asked whether he believes the Wizards want him, whether they trust and believe in him, Hakamura was again cagey. We're going to find out, he said. That the Wizards and Hakamura have arrived at this point would have been hard to imagine just a few years ago. When Washington drafted Hakamura, the Wizards embraced all that came with the 24-year-old's Japanese heritage. The team launched a Japanese website, hired a Japanese correspondent to connect to the country's fans, and even partnered with a Tokyo-based company to sponsor Hakamura's press conferences. That sponsorship has since ended but the on-court results matter. And there, Hakamura hasn't developed in the manner that Washington's executives might have hoped. Over the past two years, Hakamura has mostly come off the bench, including in all 30 of his games this season. In his fourth year, Hakamura has averaged 13 points in 24.3 minutes per game. He's missed significant time, too. Last season, Hakmura didn't make his debut until the Wizards' 40th game after a months-long absence due to personal reasons. This season, Hakamura missed 16 games because of an ankle injury. A little bit of inconsistency, Wizards coach Wes Unseld Jr. said before the Magic game when asked to asses Hakamura's season. I will say defensively he's been better. Still, there are nights when Hakamura shines. Against the Magic, he thrived on the wing and scored in spurts. Ten of his 30 points came during a two-and-a-half-minute stretch in the second when he poured in back-to-back three-pointers, a smooth finish at the rim and a jumper from the mid-range. Hakamura's ability to be a spark plug could make him an appealing trade target. Perhaps another club can also offer him a larger role. This season, Hakamura has been part of what Unseld called a log jam at power forward. The Wizards have a number of options to play the four with starter, Chris Des Porzingis, Hakamura, Kuzma, Denny Abdija, and Anthony Gill. Hakamura has spent a lot of his minutes overlapping with Kuzma. Everybody believes they should be playing more or doing more or shooting more, Kuzma said. That's natural when you're playing this sport. It's okay to think that way. It's the nature of the sport. Like Hakamura, Kuzma will likely be a free agent at the end of the season as he's expected to decline his $13 million player option. But the Wizards have reportedly signaled to teams that they are uninterested in trading the 27-year-old, who is averaging a career-high 21.7 points per game, 
and instead will try to re-sign him. That approach fits in line with how general manager Tommy Shepard has operated. The executive declined to trade guard Bradley Beal and forward Davis Bertans before they reached free agency and went on to sign them to large contracts. Bertans' five-year, $80 million contract turned out to be a glaring mistake, though Shepard was able to trade the Latvian and guard Spencer Dinwiddie last season for Porzingis. If Shepard trades Hakimura, he'll be moving on from his first, first-round draft pick as the team's lead drafter. Shepard's tenure as general manager began months before selecting Hakimura out of Gonzaga. I know what I can do, I can help the team to win, Hakimura said. It's either here, or, for, other team. I can help teams win a game. I know that. Matthew Paras can be reached at paras at washingtontimes.com. Copyright Copyright 2023, The Washington Times, LLC. Click here for reprint permission. Please read our comment policy before commenting. Click to read more and view comments, click to hide.